널 만난 건 해군이야. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly, following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk-yeol took office two years ago. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. To make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. To make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. Then he repeated his view. Then he repeated his view. Then he repeated his view. That American democracy itself was at stake in November. That American democracy itself was at stake in November that American democracy itself was at stake in November. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election, he quipped. I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old. 
Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. Question: When is the U.S. presidential election? South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly. Following the heavy defeat of the president's party, following the heavy defeat of the president's party, following the heavy defeat of the president's party, in parliamentary elections, in parliamentary elections, in parliamentary elections, South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly. Following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met. The two have not met. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. Since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. Since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. Question: How many times have they met since President Yoon took office? Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. In its latest new currency, the third in a decade. In its latest new currency, the third in a decade. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes. The government hopes. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold or ZIG will help control soaring inflation. Zimbabwe Gold or ZIG will help control soaring inflation. Zimbabwe Gold or ZIG will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. And persuade people to move away from the US dollar. And persuade people to move away from the US dollar. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold or ZIG will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. 
The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes Zimbabwe Gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the US dollar. Question. What's the name of the new currency? A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. A study in the Gambia has found A study in the Gambia has found A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children in the fight against measles in young children in the fight against measles in young children a study in the gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children a study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the trial found the trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. The immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. The immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. Question: How effective is a stick-on vaccine patch when compared to injections? Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. Apple says Apple says Apple says it's trying to fix a problem it's trying to fix a problem it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear. It's unclear. It's unclear. How many people have been affected by the fault? How many people have been affected by the fault? How many people have been affected by the fault? Which has led users to oversleep. Which has led users to oversleep. Which has led users to oversleep. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. 
Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. Question: How many people are affected by the fault? President Biden has used his speech at the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner in Washington to make fun of himself and his rival Donald Trump. Age will be an issue in the election. He quipped, "I'm a grown man running against a six-year-old." Then he repeated his view that American democracy itself was at stake in November. South Korea's president and opposition leader will hold talks shortly, following the heavy defeat of the president's party in parliamentary elections. The two have not met since President Yoon Suk Yeol took office two years ago. Zimbabwe has begun circulating notes and coins in its latest new currency, the third in a decade. The government hopes Zimbabwe gold, or ZIG, will help control soaring inflation and persuade people to move away from the U.S. dollar. A study in the Gambia has found that a stick-on vaccine patch could be an effective alternative to injections in the fight against measles in young children. The trial found the immune response to the patch was as strong as it was to an injection. Apple says it's trying to fix a problem that's causing some iPhone alarms to remain silent. It's unclear how many people have been affected by the fault, which has led users to oversleep. 시청해 주셔서 감사합니다. 다음 시간에 뵙겠습니다.